And we're back. We're going to go right down the street here to Tractor Supply. We may make a pit stop on the way, actually. Got to go slow here. We're going to get out of this little corner over here. We're going to make a little pit stop up here, too, because I see a repair shop. I think we're going to go there and see if the truck needs any oils or tires or just something. We're not going to do any upgrades, but we can see if it has any uh, wear and tear type Turn stuff, left. since we're driving right by it. Wouldn't hurt to do that. <clears throat> we don't usually do that. I, I have said, since I started playing the game, I have said that they should allow you to do repairs at your own garage. That's why people have garages. That's why trucking companies have garages. They can change your own tires. They can do oil changes. They can do those things. Uh, in the game, no, you can't. In the game, you um, have to go to a repair shop. The only time I saw that earlier when I saw it. I think they may have it now. In uh, uh, Maybe, I don't know. I haven't seen it much, but I did see it in Tallahassee, Florida on Coast to Coast. But I have not seen it any other time. When it's on the cement, it's kind of hard to see. Time to get the job done. Time to get the job done? What are you talking about? Time to get the job done? What in the world? <clears throat> okay, yeah, we need a little bit of work. Not, not a lot. We need a little bit of work. Service recommendations. Let's repair all. Confirm. Okay, that takes care of that. Now we get back on the road. I wouldn't get back on the road here. Okay. Now we can go pick up our load and get on the road. Can't really tell, can we? Come on. Stay right, and then continue straight. Go straight. I want to change those mirrors. I'm going to see if they have another mod for those. I don't like those mirrors like that. <coughs> I want to see if they have the other ones that are a little bit smaller up towards the top. Those are a little bit too big. Take up the view everywhere. They're kind of gaudy. See if we can change those out to something maybe a little bit better. Stay left. Then turn left. 
turn left. Turn right. Safe and sound. Let's do this. Let's do this.
right. I see a Starbucks. That's for the red light, not an accident. Or a breakdown or something. It looks like it's an accident. No. Good. Cool. Now it's an accident. <laughs> Just like real life, folks. Welcome to real life trucking. Wow. Go straight. Now on this one, we should pick up Shadron, which will give us 9 out of 12. And then we have some other ones that we have, well, that gives three more we have to do. So, but I think we're at, what are we, 8 out of 12 or 9 out of 12? I don't know. Anyway, whatever's left is left. We'll get them. We'll figure it out. And we'll do it together. In the meantime, go like this video, share this video, subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. I notice most people that watch my videos are not subscribed, like 70 or 80 percent of them. It's, yeah, kind of crazy that many people are not subscribed. It only takes a second and doesn't hurt at all. But it sure helps me. I don't know how many hidden roads are in this Nebraska part of the game. Um, I found one. And I haven't really looked it up to see if there's more. That was a new feature they came out with not too long ago. Where they had some hidden roads that you could come across and travel. Sometimes they're a little bit more difficult to find than that one. That one I happened to see it on the map when I was at a viewpoint. And I saw it on the map and I oh, we got a hidden road. And went and checked it out. But usually it's just a little, little blip on the side of the screen here. And say, wait a minute, that's a hidden road. 
and you don't always know. Sometimes it's, it shows a road going like to the right or to the left or straight ahead or whatever, but it's actually got the X's on it. You can't cross it. And some of them don't have the X. Well, you don't know till you go there. So you can see it on the map and you still don't know. You don't know until you get to the location and check it out. We just happened to fall into that one. I wasn't even thinking about hidden roads, actually. And I saw that, and I started thinking, well, maybe they've got them in Nebraska. So, checked it out. Kind of cool. We are in Shadron. Stay right, and then continue straight. Shadron. Go straight. I 
are coming out of here, we need to find a load going to Sydney. Go straight. straight. Stay left, and then turn left. Well, they sure didn't let you know that. Or turn you left. They sure didn't let you know that one in time. was a nice ride. We did it. Okay. See what number we're at. See where we are on the numbers. Nine out of 12. Okay. So what else do we have to do here? We've hit almost all the roads here. Look at that. Look at all that yellow in the state. And we have to go to Sydney. Alliance. What else? What else did we miss? Whoops. Okay, let's go here. Go over here and see which ones we haven't gone to yet. It doesn't tell us. Okay. I bet it's Omaha. I bet Omaha is one of them. I bet Omaha is the other one. I'm going to guess it's Omaha. Because we have two here, which is Sydney and Alliance. So if we go to Sydney and then back up to Alliance, we might be okay. Then we have to go back over to Omaha. Because Omaha was where we started out. And we actually went to Lincoln to pick up a load. So we did not actually deliver or pick up an o in Omaha. There you go. Okay, let's see what they have coming out of this area. Uh, 
and we need to go to Sydney. Right there, Walmart, waste paper, Walmart, Walmart. We could actually go back to, we could find something going to Omaha. Yeah, we could maybe take something to Omaha. That could work. Because that would be a long trip, but we have to go to Omaha anyway. And then Omaha back to Sydney would give us, would finish us up. Hmm. No, it wouldn't, because we still have to go to Alliance. Doggone it. Well, it's complicated, folks. It's complicated. We'll figure it out. We will figure this out. Let's see how far is Alliance. 56 miles. And Sydney is... 107, so that's not going to work either way because we're not going to be able to come back to Alliance and pick up Alliance because it's not over 100 miles. So, there you go, folks. There you go. We could take we could take waste paper from Walmart to waste management. We can do that. And we'll do that one on the next one. We'll see you when we see you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share. And hit that whatnot thing down there and see if you like it. See you when we see ya. Bye.